So in this video, we're going to look at some examples of differentiating with fractional and negative indices. Okay, so although um, subtracting one sounds like it should be all right in multiplication, I would have your calculator ready just in case. Okay, so for this first one, y is equal to x to the third plus x to the minus one. So dy by dx. The third comes down to the front, so we get one third x, and then we take one off the power. One third take away one is minus two thirds. Then we've got plus x to the minus one. So the minus one comes down to the front, and then we take one off the power. Okay, and so that would be the first derivative. For number two, dy by dx, 4x cubed, well that's a normal one, so we've got 12x squared. Then we've got minus 5 quarters coming down and multiplying with that minus 2. So minus 2 times minus 5 quarters is positive, so plus 10 quarters. So 10 quarters is 5 halves, okay? So we've got 5 halves x and then we've got to take one off the power so minus five quarters take away one is actually minus nine quarters and then we've got that plus eight which we know differentiates to zero for this last one we've got seven x to the nine halves so nine halves comes down and multiplies with the seven so that's 63 halves and then you need to take one off the power 9 halves take away 1 is 7 halves. Then we've got take away. The 2 sevenths comes down to the front, multiplies with the 4 to make 8 sevenths. X. Then you want to take 1 off the power. 2 sevenths take away 1 is minus 5 sevenths. And then finally, you've got the 6 elevenths coming down and multiplying with the 5 halves. So you're going to get 30 over 22 which is uh, 15 elevenths x, and then take 1 off the power. 6 elevenths take away 1 is minus 5 elevenths. Okay? So, to check, make sure you use your calculator just in case, because you don't want to make a silly mistake with indices um, in the exam. So even though you may well be fully confident, you might want to check like 6 elevenths, take away 1, and that gets to be minus 5 elevenths. So don't be afraid to check using your calculator.